In this video, I'll show you how you can set up a voice changer on Windows. This is easy, this is free, and let's get started with the video right now. So the first thing you need to do is open up any web browser, go to Google, and just do a search for Clownfish. Clownfish is the app that we're going to use to change our voice, and we just want to click on the first one here, clownfishtranslator.com. This can be used for Skype, Discord, or any like online games. Just anywhere that has a voice input, basically, you can use this on your computer. So what you need to do is you need to go to Clownfish Voice Changer. You can read more about the voice changer here and the type of voices it has, but go to download and then download it for your version of Windows. Once you download it, you'll get an .exe file. Just go and run that and we can then go through the installation. So the installation for Clownfish is very simple. We just have to click next here and we can choose whether we want a start menu shortcut and a desktop shortcut. Click next again and then choose where you want to install the program. Click next again and it's then going to install. And then finally you can click install. Okay, so once it's done, click finish and that's all you have to do to install the program. So next we can go and open Clownfish. To, so to do that, click start and just type in Clownfish or use your start menu or desktop shortcut and then click enter. That's going to open Clownfish. Now it doesn't open on your screen first. You actually have to go into your taskbar down here and you should see it hidden. So Clownfish voice changer, right click on it, click set voice changer and it should open. And here we can use the voice changer. So here is the voice changer and we can obviously change our voice, but it's no good if we can't hear what we're actually saying and what the voice sounds like. So to do that and to hear what you're saying, go to Clownfish again in your taskbar and just enable this where it says here microphone and then you'll be able to hear exactly what you're saying. So we're gonna try some here. So this should, so this sound, should sound, it sounds a bit it sounds weird, a bit weird when it's through, through the headphones. Play some mutation, Play some mutation voice. voice. Now we should now sound, we should like, sound a like a robot. We've got baby, We've got baby pitch. pitch. We've got helium, We've got helium pitch, pitch, as well. pitch as well. And, and now we should, now sound, we should like sound like a female. To clear the effect, all you need to do is click on clear effect here. I've just done that. So I should be normal again. You can also mix effects together by using the effect mixer and you can also change the pitch of your voice manually as well as change the microphone sensitivity if it's too sensitive. You can then go and use it on whatever program you want to use it on on your computer. So if I go and open up Discord as an example, I go to settings, I go to voice and video. All I need to do is make sure the input device is on the default input device and Clownfish will just work and if I enable a voice, it will come through onto Discord or whatever app I'm using. 